I'm Master Cicerone Mirella Amato, and this is my friend Matt. Hey. Today we're doing our fourth beer gadget review. Number four. If you missed any of the previous ones, not to panic, I'll be posting a link which you can follow there. Right there. Get into it. So, today we are talking about the Sonic uh, Foamer, which is this lovely machine right here. The one thing I love about this is that it kind of looks like a coaster, so yes. I feel like it blends in at the home. Mm -hmm. Not like the other products where it really kind of stands out. This kind of has a place. It takes six AA batteries, which you put into the back here just by unscrewing the cover. Mm. And then with a simple switch, or flip of a switch, there you go, we got it on. Nice, so this is called the Sonic Foamer, but it mm. actually uses the same technology as our previous gadget, which is ultrasonic. This device, however, does not go into the beer, and so for conductivity, we do need to add two teaspoons of water into this little tray right here, Matt. Yes, I will do that. We've got one. I really want to spread it around a little bit, darling. Oh. Yes. Lovely. Well Perfect. executed. I know. It's like I've done it before. So this device here has actually had a moment in the spotlight. Mm -hmm. It was featured on Jay Leno. Ooh. You press the button. And look at that. Uh, guys, where can you get a head like that for $80? <laughs> this is the closest I've ever been to a real celebrity, so this is a moment for me. Wow. Well, do you want to show us how it works, Matt? Yes, of course. Now that I'm all starstruck. Okay, so we're going to open up our beer. And like all other beers that we've been pouring to show, we're going to get as little head on that as possible. Really trap in that carbonation. There we go. That should be good. All right, and then we're going to put it on to the little plate here. Into then, that puddle. Into that puddle. And then we're just going to push this button here and watch it happen. Oh, Whoa. have you ever seen something so beautiful? Look at that. I mean, it's mesmerizing almost. You just want to keep pushing it. It's addictive. I'm addicted to this button. Oh, another fun feature on this thing. Over here on the other side is a little light button. And when you press it, the lights change color. Yes, it's almost like we're in a nightclub. A little disco. Yes, get into it. So I think we can conclude, looking at this foam here, that ultrasonic waves are an effective way to knock carbonation out of beer. Mm -hmm. In fact, it might have been a little bit too effective in this case. But I can confirm that this beer here will for sure 100% pass the bloat test, which is? Cute. My one concern here, Matt, is this puddle. Mm -hmm. And uh, what's going to happen to that when you pick up the beer? I feel like we might get a drip. Okay, well, let's see what happens. Not too bad. Oh, but we got one drip. Oh, there it is. But with a little glide of your hand, it's all gone. That's a to-do. A little, test, little taste test. See what... Yeah, I definitely killed the carbonation for sure. Well, there you it's go, boys flat. and girls. Let that be a lesson to you. If you have a sonic foamer at home, don't get carried away with the button. You'll kill your beer. But it's fun. <laughs> Okay, to summarize this, what I would say is that out of all the products, it definitely is the funnest. Um, I do like the coaster design of it so that it blends mm -hmm. in. And really, out of all the products that we've used here, this really is the best foam that we've, um, that we've seen. And it's holding beautifully. Like, this is gorgeous. That's a solid head of foam right that's there. That's a solid. Like, that's amazing. For myself, I can't really get past the price. Jay Leno mentioned that it was $80 at the time. It's still sitting at $75. So for me, at that price, I can just knock the carbonation out with a proper pour. You know what? That is a steep price. And you're right. You can knock the carbonation out with a little pour, but you won't have as much fun. I can guarantee that. So in summary, the review of the Sonic Foamer is that it is riveting, but dear and drippy. A little bit, but minor detail. All right, so make sure you come back and see us next time because we're going to review our fifth and final gadget here and we're going to be talking about the frozen draft machine. Which I'm very excited about. She, she has not stopped talking about it. To make sure you catch that video, subscribe to my channel. Right there. Yes. Let's do it. Matt, do you want to take us out? Yes. Get a little mood here. Let's go. Get into it. Yes. <laughs>
tasty. I'm addicted to this button.